Welcome everybody, I'm J.R. Ellis, and today we are going to be opening up an insane number of Zanmir crown crates. These are new as of December 6th, 2018, and I have 210 of them. This is 14 of the 15 crate packs, and so this is a lot of them. We're going to go through these pretty quickly so we can get a sense of what's in them, what the drop rates are like, and hopefully give you a sense of whether or not you actually like the stuff in these, whether or not they're worth purchasing for you. So here we go, 210. I'm, I'm excited. <laughs> here we go. And we do have Twitch chat, which will be joining us right off the bat. It's going to be getting lots of new stuff. New memento right off the bat. The drum, you know, adding to your musical collection. And some of these really bright body markings. We'll see more of these as we go through, but really, really bright green. Let's go ahead and set that as active. <laughs> okay. We'll, we'll see how these are at the end, too. We'll preview everything at the end. Ooh, Lizard Elite 4 Fabric Skirt Set. That will look beautiful on my male character, I think. Showing a lot and more of these bright body markings. There we go. There we go. It's going to be a lot of them. <laughs> it's a lot of clicks. We'll be getting a lot of gems along the way. I started with two crown gems, so whatever I get is going to be just adding up what we have. Nice looking hat with the big feathers at the top. Oh, bonus. Bonus. Two purples in this one. New pet. We'll be getting lots of experience scrolls, I'm sure. Butterscotch Dragon Frog. It's it's colorful. I like the kind of poison color looks. And have a stock of one with a follow. Thank you. Welcome to our crate opening. Here we go. Another bonus. Two purples again. Two purples. Ah, Sephardo I had from an another event. I only had like two of the collectibles from this before we started. Okay, and Deadwater Blood Body Tattoos. Bright red. If you're into the body markings. Not a big fan of the body markings myself. I usually cover up. <laughs> Head to toe. <laughs> horn, horn, horn to tail. These gems Adornment. Usually have a helmet on and a costume. Oh, the white hen. Everybody's talking about there are two chickens. There are two chickens. We'll see. We have a hen. They lay eggs. They lay eggs. It's it's amazing. Make a selection. The only other chicken was a, a demon cockerel before. The demon cockerel does not lay eggs. Just a spoiler there. First gold card. Vorplasm Battle Axe. This is an outfit style, so this will just be added to your outfit collectibles so that you can go and outfit your weapon with this. <laughs> Vorplasm is just smothered with this green goo. Okay, we'll get probably more Vorplasm outfit weapons as we go through. Oh, Ash Hopper. Oh, didn't even look at that. Oh, no. <laughs> Wolfstar says, apparently the white hen lays a golden egg. Yeah, I heard it can lay both. Face tattoo. Kind of, kind of muted. Tabitha is super excited. I am too. Ooh, so there are more furnishings this time. The rare plants that you can see throughout Markmire, the animated ones that usually want to go disable. Here's a lantern mantis, and then you can put that in your home. You'll have more cool animated stuff. And the Cliff Strider pet. Aw, is cute. Parosia says the Voroplasm weapons have a glob of pulsing goo on them. Yeah. I, I didn't know it pulsed. I just kind of thought it was there. Maybe bright? I didn't know they pulsed. That's cool. Yeah, that's what the Voroplasms do. The big bulbous things. Make a selection. Gems, okay, we'll get, we'll go through this faster and faster as I get duplicates. Marsh Lord formal bug shell robes. Good looking Argonian look. Okay, cool. <laughs> Tiger says the plants can kill you in your house. Be careful. Wait, is that true? Wait, is that true or is that <laughs> that that would be something? Scrolls. Are you ready to the rewards? Why not? Will you okay, we're again? twenty in. Your tenacity is 
see more face tattoos. It looks very similar to the other one. This one's white instead of yellow, though. Oh, bonus. The demon chicken! <laughs> you see the red glowing eye. You see the red glowing eye. This is the one. It can lay a fiery demon egg. That'll be good. That'll be good. Are you ready to reveal your rewards? So Springy says, yeah, T got zapped by one of hers earlier. <laughs> oh, we got more face tattoos. The LG one. Bright green. Your rewards are great. Well, things that can kill you in your own house, or things that can kill J-Hart in your house. I mean, I do tour a lot of houses on the stream, so I imagine... I imagine they'll die a lot more going forward. That will be, that will be rewarding. That will be rewarding to anybody. <laughs> Here we go. I'm excited. Oh, purple. <laughs> the other gold one's a scroll. Up to a hundred gems so far, just based off of duplicates. These gems can be traded for special rewards in the store. Rocha says, the demon chicken is smaller, has smaller tail feathers, and has a smaller comb waddle than the cockerel. Yeah, I had looked at that too. Oh, Nightfall Saber Cat. Ooh, it's kind of kind of snazzy. Good mount, good mount. Yeah, the chicken and the cockerel are a little bit different. <laughs> Another saber cat. Time for a repeat performance. Make a selection and reveal your rewards. Hoping, hoping for one of the lizard mounts here before too long. I have a lot more chances. Here we go. Really like that saber cat. Appropriate. And duplicates are appropriate. No. <laughs> well, uh, new blue. It does have four eyes. It's a cutie. It's a cutie. Craglorn Well, uh. Oh. Kaleidotropic Dragon Frog. Fancy. Fancy. Can... I don't know if that one can shoot fire. I believe it will flick its tongue out at bugs and stuff, though, so it's kind of fun. <laughs> Everybody's putting F in in the chat whenever I get an experience scroll. That's <laughs> a lot. Oh, there are die stamps. I'm not a fan of the die stamps. I know some, some people like them. Um, they're not really for me. Bonus. Here we go. Oh. 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 We got. We got. We got some sort of apex. We got an apex. First one. Bear lizard. Bear lizard. I think I like the bear lizards. A lot. You can actually find bear lizards out in the, the Merkmire swamp. So at least it kind of has some familiarity to me. Bear lizard. Awesome. Awesome. Exciting, exciting. These gems can be traded for special rewards in the store. Bonus. Two gold cards, two gold cards. <laughs> it is a lot of gems. And then I can get whatever I don't get. More ash hoppers. There are people wondering about the item slots. There are like six different die stamps, so they're just all different configurations of the colors. I'm feeling this. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get an apex, radiant apex, before too long. Before too long. Okay, we are now 50 in. We've done 50 crates. <laughs> Your rewards are 
special rewards in this store. The mo there we go. So there's an alchemical green winter wheat. Different different colored dye stamp. All very murky, little lizardy colors. Proteus says, "Does anyone actually use the XP boost scrolls? I don't think they're worth it. I mean, you can compare it to like the Ambrosia. Oh, oh, got another Apex." Ooh, ooh, exciting, exciting. Let's click everything. <laughs> what will it be? What will it be? Oh! Oh, that's... That is something. Now, this is my second sweet roll. My second sweet roll I've ever got. So, and the first one from these crates. The drop rates on these are incredibly rare. Incredibly rare. So... No, 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 people were saying this is worth 400 gems. Now, you can turn this in for 400 crown gems and get, like, a radiant ape, you know, you know, get an apex mount of your choice, not radiant, get an apex mount of your choice. But why would you do that when it's, like, the most rare furnishing in the game? Yeah, of course, and it gives us a, this light, glowing effect. Yeah, this, this, this stays like this. <laughs> Here we go. Keep it, Fire Lady says. That's, that's the plan. Well, I'm excited. That's, that's basically as good as a radiant. <laughs> so she's like, don't tell him not to break him. Apex, Apex. This is my luck. This is my luck because because I wasn't gonna decon that sweet roll like everybody was telling me to. I get another Apex mount <laughs> or another sweet roll. Oh! <laughs> no! <laughs> that was too funny. Unless if they actually increased the drop rate for this. I, maybe they did. I'm not so sure. As far as I know, as far as I know, as far as I know, this is super rare. You wouldn't think it based on my luck here. That's, that's amazing. Man, growing an army, growing my army of sweet rolls. More sweet roll. No. <laughs> oh, another one of the rare furnishings. Purple lightning flower. That's really cool. I, I imagine people are actually going to end up buying a lot of these with gems. Just because they're going to really feel, fill out your garden nice. Purple. <laughs> says, what's better than one sweet roll? Two, definitely. Just need more sweet rolls, more sweet rolls, infinite sweet rolls. Or you know, I I wouldn't mind a, a, a lizard every once in a while. Here's the white body marking. So we got the white one, we got the yellow one, we got the green one, we got the blue one. So lots of different colors on those. Continuing along, a little faster here. Up to 400 gems, just from duplicates, and that means I can get whatever whatever I want. And that was after opening like 65 crates. After 65 crates, I had enough gems without even deconning any of the potions or anything yet. Keep going, we'll keep going. Select your rewards, my friend. <gasps> Are you ready to reveal your rewards? Die stamp. More die stamps. <laughs> getting more, getting more. Now, I will be surprised if after all this I don't have pretty well everything but the Apex. Zanmir Do Doyen Warship's Robe. It's kind of fancy. Covers up a lot. As opposed to some of the other Argonian dresses. So if you want to be a bit more modest, there you go. More static pitcher plants. These will definitely not be deconned. <laughs> The more, the more of those I get. I mean, I'd rather get these plants than those. 
XP scrolls. These gems can be traded for special rewards in the store. The one behind me. These precious gems can be traded for my company. Where'd that scamp come from? These gems can be traded for special rewards in the store. This is one of those things where people will probably figure out where I am and like want to come and swarm me. Oh, it's just too bad that the pets don't count as furnishings. I would not mind just having an army of chickens in a home. We're up to 500 crown gems. Okay, we have, we have the demon chicken already. Guard chickens, yes, yes. Stormhawk says I would have like 50 Nyx hounds in your house. <laughs> I know, I know. Well, we're up to th what, we're up to three chickens at this point that you can have in your home. That's not that's not bad. I think they'll keep adding more. Oh, new hat. Zamir Feather Tiara. It's pretty fancy. I wonder if these can be colored. Because if you could make these more colorful, that would be nice. These are pretty brown. You know, that's, that's a look, too. Could there be anyone more lazy than the person who has a selection? These precious gems can be traded for valuable rewards. Make oh, double gold. <laughs> Alchemical, forest, outlaw, opaque. Okay, different combination on that. Bonus, here we go. Wait, roll. No. <laughs> I'm I've been spoiled. I've been spoiled. Oh, love the his you know I love guards. You know you know Stormhawk loves guards. I love guards because if I said I didn't like guards, Stormhawk would probably do terrible things to me. His guard, love the his guard. Nice and bright colors on that his guard. Once more, my good friend. Wait, I'm at <laughs> people talking about CP. I'm at 1336 CP. I'm one away, just one away from 1337. Here we go. Gold card is. Oh, yeah, this is only my second Voroplasm weapon. Now, bow is probably the one I would want the most out of these, so. Because I, I, wear, I wear a bow on my back bar. I think I like like the look of it okay it's kind of a spicy green color i can i can get behind that excited are you a big argonian fan too i like argonian stuff all right i think it gets a bad rap it's probably not the most popular as in it's probably the among the least popular races in the game but that's where we are with Merc Mai right now. It's a, it's a it's a different look. I see that America Griffin behind me. <laughs> I see that. Is that Storms? <laughs> Probably. And no, how many people are on me? <laughs> okay, this will be our one hundredth crate. Our one hundredth crate. Oh, okay, there aren't too many people here. Okay, continuing along. We are 100 crates in. 110 to go. Opening more Zanmir crown crates. We've opened 100. Got 700 crown gems from doing that. Miss Kitty says, oh, hi, my handsome guildmaster. Aw, oh, thank you. <laughs> It's going to mostly be duplicates going forward. We've already opened a hundred. At least most of the blues, most of the purples, a good chunk of the golds are going to be duplicates. Oh, Memento. A Valsa Saddle. It's the, it's the frog instrument where it has all these little colorful poison frogs in them and they make these little ribbit chirps and and they make these like deep croaky music. 
sounds. It's kind of fun. So that's a cool memento. Argonian Vuvuzela. <laughs> it's too bad that's not the furnishing. It's a memento. But for the furnishing, I love it. Totally. Apex. It's our fourth apex. Guar Lizard. Oh, love the Gwar's. Gwar's Gwar probably usually going to be my favorite of the six that you can get. Guar Lizard. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Leo says, I really want the uh, frog instrument as a uh, furnishing and the drum. Yeah, they'd be, they'd be beautiful furnishings. I mean, they have the model for it. They'll probably release it. You know what they could do? They could add that as a music box. They could add it as a music box. That'd be cool. There's only one... Okay, we have 100 crates to go. There's only one music box in the game so far. And it's been really popular, so I think they'll add more music boxes going forward. It's like walk into a room and you get closer to it and the sound gets... Uh, more pronounced, and it, it's it's a really cool effect. It, I think it's really nice. Grocious says Khajiit will probably get a chapter next year. I like the Khajiit. I mean, I think everybody li likes the Khajiit. <laughs> People messing with my lights. It's a blessing from the divines. Do you believe it? Moving <laughs> on to the next one. Make a selection. More, more. Okay, I'm now at 800 crown gems, which is enough to buy two of the apex mounts, and it took me about 120 crates to get that. Just if you're keeping track of the gems, because the gems end up being really important after you're done trying your luck at just getting things straight up. We'll end up with a lot of gems. Whoa, purple, purple, and gold. Now, I had the fire pet from a, from a previous thing. That was one of the two things I had before I started this. Bonus is purple. And I'll decon everything at the end that I don't want to keep, which is going to be most of it. You know, decon all the potions and things like that. Oh, Bright Throat Scale Skin. This is, like, really, really bright. Like, it makes sense on an Argonian, but you put it on, like, a like a more, like, traditional human form, and it just, it's, like, really bright. <laughs> I'm actually kind of happy about that one. Fun skin, fun skin. Your rewards are there. Yeah, we'll end up with a lot of gems, but that's the thing with the furnishings is if you end up with a lot of gems, you can just sink them all into those <laughs> purple lightning plants or the the other ones. There's there's one plant I have not got yet. One of them I have not got yet. Hopefully, I get at least one of them. Make a selection and reveal your rewards. This could be helpful. Your rewards are ready. Well deserved. Opening a lot of crates. Ah. Are you ready to reveal your rewards? Most fragrant. <laughs> Getting a few writing lessons along the way too. Might use those for my other characters. Pakroti envies your glistening gems. But things like food and stuff, you, you don't want to be keeping those. Baradin 01 with the follow, thank you so much. Opening, opening more Zanmir crown crates. Wish me luck, wish me luck. I've had a dry spell here. I had a bonus, bonus 33 gems. Up to a thousand crown gems. Another bonus. 
Okay, new Deadwater blood face tattoos. Those are very bright there. Very red. If you want that. Won't see them underneath my cow helmet, unfortunately. But maybe have a character that will work on. Now, I definitely know I'm still missing several, several big pieces here. Voroplasm stuff, missing a skin, missing plants, missing most of the apex. Oh, the one Voroplasm I get is a duplicate. <laughs> I have the axe, I have the bow. Missing some of the others. Okay, opening more. Opened 140 so far. I've got two resplendent sweet rolls. <laughs> which is crazy. And a bear lizard and a guar lizard. So, there, there, there we go. That's the third plant furnishing, the gas blossom. It's the first one I've got. They just kind of emit this poison aura around them. And my understanding is that these are dangerous and they will hurt you in your own house or they will hurt guests. So have fun with that. <laughs> make, make a big room of them that your guests fall into. I think, I think that would be the best thing to do. That's my first instant all research. I don't really have characters that will benefit from that. Maybe I'll hold on to the instant research just in case if I create another character I, I want leveled up. Two purples. Lots of gems. Let's just add a memento again. <laughs> Croatia. Woman is going to find inventive ways to murder us. I know. So let's see. We've opened 150 crates so far. 150. We have 60 left. I'm wanting a Radiant Apex. Like, if I open 200 and don't get a Radiant Apex, I'm going to be... A little sour, just a little bit. I'm, I'm feeling that it's going to happen, though. <laughs> just one. Because this is probably it. It, it. These 210 are... I don't plan on getting any more after this. I did get two sweet rolls. There we go. Ooh, here we go. Here we go. It's going to be... It's going to be Radiant, and it's probably not going to be the one I like the most. Or it's going to be a Lizard. Sench Lizard. At least it wasn't a duplicate. <laughs> it wasn't the Guar or the Bear. So this is our third out of six of the Lizard Steeds. We have the Bear, we have the Guar, and we have the Sench so far. So, that's pretty good. This one wishes you great luck. Sweet meat. Your tenacity is you know, you buy enough of these and it's not really... <laughs> people talking about it as gambling. You know, you buy enough where you can basically get all that you want with gems. Or, you know, you just get enough gems so that you can buy the, the couple pieces that you want. Then it's just more like a normal transaction. You can't just... You can't just rely on the RNG to get what you want. So, that ends up being an issue. If I'm buying enough, the RNG ends up <laughs> averaging out. I'll just be able to get most everything. And then if I don't get all the Radiant Apexes, if I don't get any of the Radiant Apexes, then that's just how that happens. No Radiant Apex so far. Opened a hundred and 
60 crates. Now during the last opening I did of Scale Crawler, I got a Radiant Apex on my 10th crate. <laughs> so, uh, that was lucky. 44 to go. Bonus. Bonus purple. Only a few things I'm missing at this point. We have 42 crates to go. Getting a lot of gems. I'm up to over 1,200 crown gems. That's enough to get all three of the other Apex mounts I don't have. And I haven't even deconed on my potions. So I'll probably end up with enough crown gems that I'll be able to buy everything. And then a couple of each of the cool plant furnishings. That's, that's my plan. Opening more, opening more. Wondrous gems are so sparkly. Make a selection to reveal your rewards. A suitable reward. I think overall the crown crates do have a lot of value in them because you open up even just a couple, you're gonna get probably a new pet or a mount or like a skin or something, and you look at the ones that are unique on the guild traders, and those go for like hundreds of thousands of gold each. Well, you know, that, that's all the time you spend getting that much gold for it. Compared to, you know, opening 15 and getting a handful of collectibles. If It's just a matter of whether you're picky about what you're getting. But, you know, getting a couple, couple pets or whatever, right, that, that can be good value. I don't know. We have 30 left. 30 left. I need... I need... something. <laughs> I need... I'm hoping... I'm hoping this batch gives me a Radiant. 210 is a lot. And 210 is a lot to not get a Radiant. No, I did get two Sweet Rolls. Two Resplendent Sweet Rolls. That was maybe a little crazy, but I I probably probably would have preferred the Radiant. Just saying. Make a selection to reveal the reward. <laughs> Shall we try again? Hey Blinken says, get this man what he wants already. No, I'm Here we go! Oh, oh, oh it's it! It's it is it. I swear it had particle effects. I swear it had additional particle effects. It's going to be it's gonna be... <laughs> it's gonna be... It's gonna be Radiant. Boom! Boom! Chilling Sench Lizard. It's the one I wanted the most. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I swear it had more particles as it flipped over. I, I'm not quite certain on that. I, I think it might have, though. Beautiful, beautiful, amazing. I'm excited. Everybody congratulating me. Thank you so much. <laughs> hey, Blinken says, see, I did this for you. I, I'll, I'll, I'll give you all the credit. There you go. There you go. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. So, so far we've had three... Apex mounts, a Radiant Apex mount, and two Sweet Rolls. It's a good haul. I was, I was getting a little worried there. I'm happy now. Well, I, whatever else I get, I'll be okay. Whatever else I get. <laughs> but man, this was a lot of crates. I, I got a lot of crates. And then we'll preview everything at the end here, too. Now, I wouldn't mind getting another... Apex here that I don't have to spend 400 gems on. Because that's more plants I could buy. <laughs> Golden Hummingbird says that's the best one! I know, I know. I think it is. I like the chill sedge look. The ice look. I think it stands out the most. And maybe, <laughs> maybe it does have a taste for tackiness. No. 
Double die stamps. Beautiful, beautiful. Make a selection to reveal your rewards. Pakruti admires your persistence. Your rewards are Eleven left. Just eleven crates left. Bonus. Bonus gems. Pretty well, I'll give you gems. Next one. Nine left. Just a few chances left to get something amazing. Like if I were to get a second Radiant Apex. That would be cool. That would be cool. <laughs> let's, let's just jinx myself into this one. Purple. Bright moons. Bright moons indeed. Oh, somebody talking about doing giveaway. We'll do a couple giveaways for Twitch chat at the end too. Okay, two left. Two last two chances. Then I'll be I'll be done with the Zanmir crates for the rest of the season. I hope. <laughs> Resist temptation. Okay, ended up with about fifteen hundred crown gems after that. That's pretty nice. Okay, gem extraction. Resplendent Sweet Rolls do decon for 400 each. I got two of those somehow. We'll be, we'll be deconning the Experience Scrolls. <laughs> I don't want to mess up my decons here. All right, what's from these? These for from the other crates. Instant All Research. I'm. May hold on to that in case if I actually make another character I want to level up. You can decon the plants. I don't want to do that though. I got two of the purple ones. Which is probably my favorite one. It's the one I got the most of. Got 54 Gold Coast Experience Scrolls. It's a lot. We have a follow from Evil Briad. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to our crate opening stream. Having fun with this. I did not get that many crown riding lessons. I got 10 of them. I got 10 of them. I'm gonna keep those, I hope. I did get 39 crown mimic stones. I deconned all the other ones from before. I'm gonna decon these as well. I'd rather put that towards a plant. <laughs> Did get one Gas Blossom and one Land Hermantis. I want to make sure I don't decon those accidentally. More research. These are just one, one day each. I think I'll get rid of those. So I got 9 Riding Capacity, 14 Stamina, and 10 Speed. I had a couple in my bank already. Okay, and that should do it. So after all that, I, I'm keeping some of the stuff, not gemming everything. I have 2,700 crowns. 2,700 crowns. <laughs> Let's see what I did not get. I, I did not get the skin. Let's go ahead and purchase that. <laughs> You know, you can buy as many of these plants as you need. You know, as many as you want for your house, you can put those there. Oh, I did not get the Nyx Ox. I did not get the Cub. I'm wanting to see if I actually got enough to buy everything. I did not, these are 200 each. Oh, that's kind of, so these actually maybe are a bit more, these might even be, be a bit more rare. They do have these pulsing Voraplasm on it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy these anyway. They're 200 gems, not 100 like some of the other legendaries. And the sword does have that Vorplasm pulsing on it. Can buy more plants. I did get 
all of the epics. I should have got all the superior. Yeah, and then we'll, we'll go through and preview these. So, you can see... You see these okay? Got... You can do the, the, can do the previews one of two ways. You can either look at the rewards here and click on them all or you can you can just look from the crown crates right here okay we got the bear i'm gonna buy the camel there's a guar with it's like a super lizard guar is already pretty lizardy and they made it even more lizardy we have the horse lizard We have the Sench Lizard. Has a pretty good look. I maybe need to get away <laughs> from other people here. And we have the Wolf Lizard. It's a very lizardy mouth to it. Okay, well, I bought everything. I bought everything, and I still have 800 crown gems. That's 800 crown gems I can put towards whatever plants I want. And then here's the bright throat scale skin. Really colorful. Gives you some little bumpies around as well. Your neck's all colorful. Your forehead's colorful. It's a, it's a good look. Deadwater scale skin. You have these really kind of purplish, greenish skin colors. <laughs> and we've got well, the five pet... pet Spider, you could get this before this uh, crown crate season, but this is available now. Gas blossom furnishing. Now, if, if I wait, yeah, it'll have this green gas coming out of it. And supposedly, it is, oh, this, this is something I didn't realize. It is a furnishing behavior. It's a trap behavior. It says this exotic plant sprays gas when approached, dealing poison damage to targets in the area. So this actually can hurt you, as far as I know. Kill okay, says, Hello, help, j -Hart, hope you got something good. Yeah, I got the chill Sench. Oh, I need to preview the Radiance, too. Here's a Hisquar. Lantern Mantis. Again, it's another trap furnishing, so this can deal physical damage to you. Let's see if it will activate during the preview might need a target to do that. Okay. Here's the Lustrous Nixoc Fabricant. Nightfall Sabercat. And the Cub. Duh. I have so, <laughs> so many little cats now. Here's the, the third plant. It's a static picture. Really beautiful, vibrant purple color on this. It does have that lightning effect going around it. And it will deal shock damage to you. So it is a, it's another trap. It'll, it will hurt. I wonder if you can like place those upside down and still hurt people. <laughs> and then we have the battle axe with the goo, the pulsating goo. The bow does not seem incredibly practical. <laughs> That's kind of fun. Maybe if you're going for like a poison build, I think this is where this makes the most sense. Poison staff, right? Poison staff. Poison is generally physical damage, so it doesn't really count. Well, it's boosted by m mighty instead of all the spell damage stuff. Boosted by weapon damage. <laughs> oh, uh, you can't see that preview very well. Let me let me preview that separately. Vosa saddle. Memento. Kill a 12 with a follow. Thank you so much. Previewing the crate items that we just got. I just turned into a butterscotch dragon frog. These do have animations over time. May not. Can't wait too long. Come on, frog. Eat something. <laughs> or a demon chicken. It's Will Lay Eggs. Maybe not on command. Lay an egg. Lay an egg now. <laughs> you have five seconds, Steven Chicken. Lay an egg for me.
Ignore it, we'll just peck around. No, I can't, I, I can't stay mad at that chicken face. Okay, so we have body tattoos, really bright, face tattoos, Kaleidotropic Dragon Frog. The skirt set. Oh yeah, that looks beautiful. Now I did put on this body paint when I got it, so this this isn't part of the, the set, but this is the body paint I got earlier. Formal bugshell robes. At least the armpits are breathable, but other than that, it's pretty covered up. Here's the other hen. Step out there if you didn't get that earlier. And the tiara. Now that's fun. If you want to if you want to think of yourself in a very high high regard, I think this is the way to go. And the worship robe. Now I thought this was more covered up, but it does have just kind of like a, a little bit of more of the chest is exposed than I thought, so you can show off a little, a little bit of your fuzz right there if you want. If you want, you can. <laughs> Ash Hopper, Equip Strider, Bonding Headdress. Feels more like a like a like a servant wear. There's the body tattoos, the bright green algae ones. Or you can go with the algae face tattoos. And then it's just going to be the, the chalk white. Or the woad body blue color. Or the yolk bright yellow. And same with the face white or blue or yellow. And we have the welwa. Or the tusk, or the Mire drum memento. Now this is kind of fun musical instrument. I expect many drum circles. I expect so many drum circles. And she never says my cat is totally enthralled with Jay Hart, but she does love the chickens. I bet. I bet. And then the other thing was showing off the radiance. Now here's a chilling cinch lizard. And you can upgrade that with the various upgrades. So this is everything. If you can see that, okay. And here's a scorching horse lizard. Let's go ahead and put everything on that as well. And it does have the two horns that are gl glowing bright orange there. Could probably cut about anything with that. And then here's a venomous wolf lizard. All right, cool. I did get this chilling cinch lizard, so that's let me let me activate that. And best pet would be <laughs> what's the demon chicken demon chicken or the white hen I'll go with the white hen I'll go with the white hen oh it's so cool <laughs> it's named drooler by default drooler does not make a lot of sense for chicken at least I'm thinking that okay Okay, the cinch lizard does have ice breath. That's that's kind of cool. If it weren't for your heroism, Anton will sacrifice. Okay, that I think that will do it. Mari says, "I think the chicken is a rooster. This is a rooster." No, I think this is chicken. The, the chickens lay eggs. The, the cockerel does not lay eggs. Catatonia says, a beautiful mount. 
Yes, both the chickens lay eggs, and they... This white one can lay white or gold eggs, as far as I know, and the demon one will sometimes lay demonic eggs. So, anyway, good luck to you as you open your crown crates if you decide to do that. Or, maybe, maybe you're not too excited by this crown crate season. Hopefully I've helped you to make that determination here. Had some good luck through this. I got one Radiant Apex, two Sweet Rolls, three of the Apex mounts, three out of the six, and that was out of 210 Crown Crates, which is a lot. I know, I know that's a lot, So, but I hope this gave you a sense of what to expect from these and from this Crown Crate season. So good luck, everybody, and stay spicy. Ooh.